Well, they say the larger police presence will prevent crime, but keep in mind when the man was attacked at this station yesterday, there was police patrolling the station. So I spoke to people today who are skeptical of this new safety plan, but they're desperate. Inside Bronx's 149th Street Grand Concourse subway station, riders are leaning against pillars, their backs against the walls. I feel like after seeing like that guy pushing someone it just made me so nervous. It was here a 62 year old man was waiting for the train when a 21 year old punched him so hard he fell onto the tracks. That attack followed two separate stabbings. A 21 year old man was stabbed three times while sitting on the platform of the Junction Avenue station and a 14 year old was stabbed near the 191st Street station in Washington Heights. They all survived. We need more protection. Yeah, because they put two police over there, over there, over there, but we need more. Nervous riders tell me they'll gratefully take more police officers patrolling down below. A promise made a day before the trio of attacks by the mayor and governor. But this is a plan Queens Council member Robert Holden has heard before. More police officers, more overtime shifts, and more cameras. Holden believes the mayor is trying, but is suspicious of the governor. She controls the MTA, and now she's announcing this program uh, days before an election. She should have done this a year ago. Holden says serious solutions start with more mental health facilities, cracking down on fare evaders who he believes are committing much of the crime and repealing bail reform. They keep arresting the same individuals. If you're going to do the crime, you have to do the time. And that's not happening. Mayor de Blasio started this by emptying our jails during the pandemic, and that's when crime started to go up. In the case of the 62-year-old being punched, police were patrolling the station but it did not dissuade the suspect to Sean Smith. People had a family, people go to work, you know, people try to survive, but they don't care. So in addition to this uh, security plan, MTA is going to be placing security guards at the turnstiles. Hopefully that will help weed out any bad actors. And we do have some good news. The man who was pushed onto the tracks Friday and broke his collarbone, an arrest was made today at 1130 in Queens. They arrested Lamali McRae, 41 years old. He faces numerous charges, including attempted murder. In the Bronx, Ashley Rodriguez will send it back to you in the studio. Thanks, Ashley. Three